We just got out of the Airbnb. It's 12 o'clock now, 11.30, I don't know. It's late. We're kind of having a hard time adjusting to the New York time, but at this point, it doesn't really matter because we leave tomorrow night. It's a really beautiful day out right now. So today we're gonna go back to Dumbo and I'm gonna try to get a good picture of the skyline from underneath the bridge. And while I'm doing that, Cheyenne's gonna be just working at Starbucks. She has to do some, uh, some homework for when we get back tomorrow. And after that, I think that we might go into Manhattan. I'm not quite sure yet, just kinda trying to figure it out. We got a call last night and we we're like fully approved for this apartment now. So all we have to do is go sign for it tomorrow in the morning, sign the lease and put down the, the first month's rent and it's ours. So it's really exciting. I'm really excited for that. <laughs> Yo, I already caught the scent from the sticky The guns is rolling up Always people told me I just wasn't ever old enough And intellect since young age I used to bump that jazz Always searching for some answers in the back of the class All past had me roaming through the hallways looking devious Chilling locker wells talking about ladies who's the easiest Always pump mischievous intentions out my heart of gold And watching chips of life collapse around me like they dominoes This kid nice, he make you feel them kind of groove vibes And Jerry's like I'm training for the track team running suicides He really string them words together All right I'm all finished up now. Uh, I got all geared up from Cheyenne. I took the hoodie from her. I have my jacket zipped all the way up. I got my beanie on now, so I'm gonna be super warm. Well, kind of warm. And now I'm gonna go down here. I'm gonna try to find a good picture to take. A really good picture of the New York skyline. So. Shane's just back at Starbucks doing some homework right now. So it's the perfect time for me to leave her and go get this picture. Chances of you falling off is very likely, but I'm too relaxed to feel the pressure. Never focus on the incidental shit that's all on their mental. Eating a bento on a sunny night in my Medina. Nothing cleaner than the doodle. Bring all stripes and people together like multicolored zebras. So in the end, the chapters of racist bastards couldn't stop the band of brothers. This is such a beautiful city. This is crazy. Look at this view. Oh my god, look at the sun coming out. This is so beautiful. I brought my uh, long range lens. I'm gonna try to throw that on and get a, get a good video of that carousel over there. And then maybe I'll use that to take the photo. I don't know yet. I'm gonna take a few with each lens, but this is just insane weather. It's like 20 degrees out, but blue skies. This is so pretty. I'm so excited to move here. Like two weeks could not be up soon enough. My hands are so numb right now. Oh my god, I can't even feel my hands, but the rest of these fine. There's layers on, but seeing this and like being here right now. I just don't want to go back. I don't want to go home and pack up and get all my stuff. I just want to stay. I just want to leave it all behind. From hoist and banners have been the rafters. Pineapple now, ladies, is a soundtrack, but we bring in the sound back. Team addicted to loud packs. Money ain't a thing if I got it, was never in this for it. It don't matter if you sit in Benzes or drive a Taurus through Pacific Northwest Forest or down the Golden Coast. Chosen for. It's so hard to walk over here and not be in anyone's pictures or like ruin them. I've gone all the way from this bridge behind me all the way to this bridge over here. All right, so I got my very last schedule for my job back in LA and it's just two more weeks there. Like from this day, two more weeks and then that's it. No more working in LA. And then after that, I think it's gonna be like two days of loading up a truck and then we're gonna go. And it's just so, so crazy to me because it's like two weeks ago, I was like, oh, that's so far away. Oh, that's so far away. But like now it's today 
and it's like it's all finally happening like six months in the making it's like almost here we're almost moving here here well there but here and it's like so unreal but I don't know I just never thought that New York City was like a place that I would be able to move to or like something that I would be doing in my entire life and here I am everything's all said and done here everything's like my my apartment is ready to be moved into like I'm signing a lease for it tomorrow and then after that it's just all downhill like everything is so easy after that this is gonna be the hardest part of my entire moving process and it's it's all done now everything it's crazy to me by the way you were clipped onto this part there's like a big drop back there I wasn't sure if it was gonna hold up. Soon I broke it, so. Oh no. We got strawberry shakes, hair, strawberry blind. Damn, such a beautiful combination And I know that I'm impatient We banging out the basement With a sound that got your senses alerted Like you can taste it Wasted But I ain't on that GTA page I just checked in on Cheyenne And she still has quite a bit of homework to do So I'm just walking around uh, Dumbo some more I don't even really care that much Cause like It's really cool here It's really cool to check out all the stuff that's around and all that and there's a whole bunch of good Pokemon. But other than that, I don't know what we're really doing today. I think that this might be it. I kind of want to go check out the city and some more, but I always have more time to do that once we move here in a couple weeks, so it's not that big of a deal either way. Cheyenne's done working for a little bit now, so we're gonna go to Stumptown to try to check up on my resume and see if maybe this guy can meet up with me tomorrow instead of next month uh, but yeah hopefully you can meet up with us tomorrow and then I'll be able to have the interview all done before uh, York Street East Broadway next before we move down here when you have to pee bad enough you'll pay eight dollars for a burrito We found the Goodwill. We spent like 20 minutes walking the wrong direction looking to find this stupid store. Here we go. We're going home now. Cheyenne's got shaky hands. We were gonna buy some $1 pizza but they only took cash. And we went to the ATM and we only had credit cards. And so we left without buying our pizza. We just went back home and I couldn't help but to just fall back asleep. I just woke up because we needed to go find something for dinner but I can't stay up much later. Subscribe, like, and comment if you liked today's video. And until next time, baby. Oh.